everybody. Today I want to share with you a shortcut to capture text from images. It's an idea that I got from Mac, the MacMost Now channel. And I will be asking you at the end of this video to comment below if this type of shortcut would um, cause you to move away from applications such as TechSniper, which essentially do the same thing. So let's get right into the um, short building the shortcut. I'm going to go right here to um, the shortcut uh, application. And I'm going to take uh, find the take screenshot action first. And here it is, take screenshot. Now, I'm going to change this full screen from full screen to interactive so that it'll allow you to take a portion of the screen and not be forced to take the whole screen. Um, in the iPhone, on the other hand, if you were doing this at a shortcut on the iPhone, it would force you to take a full screenshot because there's no other option on a small screen such as the iPhone. So we're going to um, change this to interactive. And then we're going to change from just the window into custom so we can decide our own sizes. And then uh, from here, we're going to do put in the next action, which is uh, extract text from, from image. And there it is, extract text from image. And that automatically goes to um, extract text from the screenshot which is up here and then we combine the <clears throat> I'm just looking at my notes over here then we combine text from the image into new lines that's the third step There it is. And then, and this tells the, um, the this tells the shortcut that the lines of text are, are going to be used as the separator of each line of text. But these can be uh, used, uh, the separators can be spaces or anything custom. Using spaces as the separator um, is good when you are copying an image that has paragraphs of text. But for this example and for this video, we will simply keep it as a default new lines. And now what we want to do is the last step, we're going to copy to clipboard. So whatever we copy, we are going to uh, put in our clipboard so that we can paste it wherever we want. So we go over here and, and type clipboard and see what we get. Here we go. Copy the clipboard. And yeah, 
And that is the end of the shortcut. And I'll leave this as the way it is. And then we are going to try it out. So I'm going to copy um, this section here and see what it uh, pastes for us. And if we did it correctly, each of these items here that are part of an image will be copied as text into our text editor. We're going to use, I believe it's TextMate. Yep. TextMate right here. So we'll have it ready to go for when we try this out. First, we're going to give it a name. We're going to call it text or image. Image to text and then we are going to um, try it out but let's first let's see if we can give it a shortcut we're gonna pin it to the menu bar so that it appears here Uh, and then we're going to um, use it as a quick action. And we are also going to give it a shortcut. We're going to do caps lock 8. And the, what that allows us to click, it'll click control, option, shift, and command with the number 8. In this example, it's put in the asterisk. I'm not sure why, but that's okay. Um, so we're going to leave it this way, and we're going to try it out. From here first, we're going to click Run, which is this Play button. So now we get the... Um, the crosshairs, we're going to select whatever we can find here. So we're going to select these three lines. And here it is. It showed you pin and menu bar, use as quick action in Finder. And let's see if it's... Um, Copy those to the clipboard. And here's our um, text editor that we're going to simply hit control, or I'm sorry, command V. Yep, and it obviously did what we wanted. Now, I'm going to open up Safari. Let's open up Safari. And here we are on um, let's do so we can make sure that we do find an actual text in images. Let's do a search for text in images. Here's the word surf in this image. And you can see here it's a, I don't know, um, it's probably a JPEG is my guess. But we can hit control and see what it is. Save image as, 
And yeah, it's a JPG. Okay, we're gonna cancel out of this. And then we're gonna do use the text sniper, which is we have running right now, and it's running right here. This is text sniper, and the shortcut for it, as you saw before, is command nine. So we're gonna go to click command nine. Try command shift nine. Yep, it was command shift nine. And then we're gonna copy this text right here. And then we're gonna go back to the text editor and command V this time. And sure enough, it pastes surf. So as you can see, we have the app like text sniper um, that'll copy text from an image or you can build your own by using Mac OS shortcuts and and executing that uh, shortcut every time you want to copy text from an image which one would you choose let me know in the comments below and please remember to like and subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out as far as the YouTube algorithm, algorithm goes. And I will see you all in the next video.